Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my vlog. I've been kind of in the groove of things when it comes to vlogging. I've been vlogging almost every single day for you guys. And I, to a very small degree, feel somewhat guilty that all of my vlogs pretty much are the same thing, but that's what happens realistically when you work. I want you guys to answer down below what you find interesting and almost comforting when you watch YouTube and what you watch people for. Like, why are you watching this video? Are you watching it for comfort? for ballet inspo because when I watch YouTube, I watch it for that reason. And it's interesting because we either watch things that we're inspired by or things that bring us joy and kind of a sense of comfort. And I personally like watching YouTubers that have more normal jobs. Like I never watch the YouTubers that fly to Fiji and fly to this place and do this tour and go here and go there because to me, it's not attainable. I can't relate to it. At the same time though, I can see how it can become boring to some people because sometimes we watch YouTube and videos and TV shows as an escape from our reality. Oh, She's a hard yeah. worker. Let me know. Now going back to my previous point, I'm not saying if you do like to watch those YouTubers that do these crazy challenges and have higher productions and don't work normal nine to five jobs because you know, you like what you like. I'm not gonna tell you what to watch and nobody should ever tell you what to watch. Just for me personally, my favorite YouTubers are always the ones that are more comforting that I can relate to more. So I just genuinely wanna hear from you guys what you relate to the most because I think that's how we can build the most solid community here, the most supportive community. And then I can give back to you guys because you guys have given me so much this year. I mean, I can't believe that we had had 16,000 people on this channel subscribe, which just makes me so overwhelmed and happy because because thinking of 16,000 people being here and supporting me, but also growing a community and being so positive and welcoming and amazing just fills me with so much joy. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I think I've said this multiple times, but I couldn't be where I am today without you guys. So thank you again. Now, before it gets too cheesy, um, I'm going to sign off. By the way, this leotard that I'm wearing is from Tutu List and it's originally from Wear Moi. The skirt also came with the order that I got from Tutu List. Check out my previous vlog where I reviewed and tried on all of the leotards and things that they sent to me. I actually did a little haul as well within the vlog, so check that out. And these leg warmers are also from Tutu List and I love the look of them. I just feel like such a ballerina, such a prima ballerina. I just feel so good and confident and aesthetic in this look. What do you guys think? Anyways, again, I'm gonna sign off before I get too cringy now. So I had a corporate client this afternoon, meaning that a lot of the work that I was doing was functional mobility work and just very basic movements, kind of like introduction to mobility. So I did that and then after I taught, I folded some laundry, put it away really, really quickly because I put some in that morning and then it was time for a shower because quite frankly, my hair was getting pretty greasy and I couldn't bear it any longer and I just had a really quick two minute shower. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jasmine McDonald. If you're new here, I post ballet and fitness related videos every single Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And welcome back to the vlog. If you're new here, I also just post ballet and my lifestyle <laughs> on my vlog. So what's new? What's new? I'm trying to think of what's new. I literally vlogged yesterday. I'm trying to compile as much material as I possibly can um, just because next week I have a lot of work I have to catch up on. I don't think I'll be able to create content as often. So I'm just preparing myself for that almost every day, but I am I'm getting ready to go to dance studio I'm teaching tonight for a couple of hours and then I'm back. I'm actually home early tonight, early being like 7.30 versus being home at like 10 o'clock, so that's kind of nice. So yeah, I'm gonna go into the studio a little bit early and you're thinking, okay, you just showered. Why would you shower before you get all sweaty and gross and stinky at dance? And isn't that count counterintuitive? And I say to that, um, no. 
because here's my logic. I wanna have a bath tonight. And before you get all up in my grill and be like, girl, you just had a shower, that's so much water. I timed my shower today and it was two minutes just to rinse my hair. I did nothing else. I literally did not like do anything in the shower. I just put my hair under, rinsed it really quick in less than one minute and then rinsed it out or washed it really quick. And then tonight I really wanna have a relaxing bath because um, yeah. I wanna do that. And then if I don't get to it tonight, that's fine. I can have a bath another day. But since we have finished our bathroom, it's just been so nice to be able to shower in our brand new shower and relax and rejuvenate in our brand new bath. So it's just been really nice to spend 24 seven in this bathroom. Really, I just spend all of my waking hours in this bathroom, either getting ready, filming content, bathing, showering, again, getting ready, vlogging. So yeah, I'm gonna go to the studio early to also film some stuff and also dance a little bit because I only teach for two hours so I can exhaust myself today. I am subbing for a teacher in another city tomorrow. So I probably won't be able to vlog much tomorrow because I'll be teaching from eight till nine, nine till 11, three until four, and then I think six until nine, something like that. So today is the vlogging day, I suppose. So let's get ready. Also, I am obsessed. Oh, I can't even reach it. With these little vases, got them from Winners. Winners. Amazing. I love them. They are fake, of course, because you know I can't keep plants that long. I mean, I still have my plants from when we first moved here. Actually, I have a cactus right there that I'm looking at that I need to water right now. But yeah, we have a lot of plants in our house and I have kept them alive. That was just a joke. I do not hurt my plants. My plants are fine for all those plant lovers. Um, they could use some more water, so I'm gonna do that really quick and then go to dance. Super cold. Oh my goodness. And my hair is wet, so that doesn't help at all. <laughs> I've had a not amazing day, so I'm gonna have a bubble bath. Bubble bath to relax. to my mom's house a because she's my mom b because she has the most adorable cats c because the internet is amazing and d because the decor is absolutely impeccable at my mom's house i had to teach a couple classes and then after that i did a little bit of a ballet bar and mittens the kitten was definitely trying to join in she loves dancing as well she's being all adorable and cute around my ankle she clearly wanted to play because she later on grabbed my loop band and ran around the house with it in her mouth. It was pretty cute, pretty adorable, but I did have to go to work, so I did have to take it from her just so she didn't destroy it by the time I got home. I would forgive her though, because she's adorable. So after I did a little bit of ballet, I went to the studio and I taught until 9.30 at night, so I closed up the vlog pretty early, guys, but thanks so much for joining. Please feel free to continue watching as Mittens the Kitten sabotages my ballet bar, but in the most adorable way possible. You're so silly. Hold us and ran away.
away. Anyways, I'm gonna close out the vlog here, guys, because I am going to be teaching out of the house in an hour, so I have to go get ready. Catch you guys later. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Stay safe, happy dancing, and bye now. You thought you weren't gonna be in today's vlog. You thought wrong.